Before we, uh, before we begin, uh, members that are present here with me this evening, to my right, Councillor DiNapoli, member of the Ordinance Committee, Councillor Moynihan, a member of the Ordinance Committee, Councillor uh, Tim Cruz is away um, and unfortunately could not be here this evening. Um, and I expect any, any moment that uh, Councillor Stewart uh, would be joining, uh, joining us. But with three members present, I, Dennis and Erie's chair, we are able to um, begin the meeting because we do have a, a quorum. So at this point in time, I'm going to um, ask that uh, Councillor Monaghan, I believe we have before us a uh, substitute ordinance. Yes, Mr. Chairman, I'd like to make a motion to, that uh, we accept a substitute ordinance. Motion to accept. Motion's been made and accepted that we accept the substitute ordinance. All in favor? Aye. Opposed? We, we accept the substitute ordinance. Uh, Mr. Chairman. Council, Council Monaghan. We have uh, Mr. Gilday. Please explain the changes. <laughs> The changes that are included in the substitute ordinance incorporate amendments that were prepared by the law department at the request of the mayor. And they change the um, section of the ordinance relative to compensation to an hourly rate of $53.75 with a maximum of $51,600 to be paid to a commissioner of police. And it also limits the number of hours that this particular department head can work to 960 hours. And the other change that's reflected in the substitute ordinance are the amendments that were discussed by the committee at the last meeting relative to the qualifications of any candidate to become commissioner of police. The final change is that this ordinance would be effective for only one year following passage by the council and approval by the mayor. So there's a sunset clause that's included in there. Thank you. Councilors, any? Uh, Mr. Chairman, I'd like to uh, make a, recommend, a motion for recommendation for a favorable, favorable recommendation to the full city council. I'll second that. Motion has been made uh, and seconded to send this back to the full city council, council with a favorable recommendation. All in favor? Opposed? This ordinance will go back to the full city council with a favorable uh, recommendation. Any other questions or concerns, councillors, to come before us this evening? Seeing as none, this meeting is adjourned. <laughs>